Have you seen the results of what we usually complain? You know, turning the kingdom business into a business empire. Turning it into a funny business. Look at the results now. The son of Olumba Olumba Obu, OOO, has challenged the pastors in Christendom. Let us be careful before I go into what he said and before you watch and listen to yourself. Do not advertise Christ for miracle. I have said it over and over again. Most pastors did not come out to condemn when a particular man compelled his member under the influence of whatever he used, they ate grasses. We saw that most pastors did not come out to condemn the man who shaved the pubic hair of his female member in a place he called a church. The one he removed the female member in his church, her undies. I wonder how many people that came out and they condemned it. We have seen people who went on their knees moving towards their pastors. So many so-called prophets have given women the bath by the riverside. Somebody's wives, some ladies, some people preached about miracle money. So many people claimed in the presence of their congregation that they called God on phone and they were making call before their church members. We have seen a lot, even those who claim that they walk on waters. We have turned soul-winning business into a funny business. But if it were tights that people came against, you will see massive attack from many big daddy GOs. Jesus Christ is not known for materialistic supply. There is a format for material blessing. Oh yes, there is a format. Even the disciples did not even boast with the miracles. Prophecy, digging of charms, they did not do that. The major purpose of Christ Jesus is in Galatians 5, 22 to 23. And also in Isaiah 51, you remember the Bible says, The Spirit of God is upon me, Christ said himself. To heal the brokenhearted, to release the captives and to give freedom to the prisoners. And the time has come when God will save his people, to comfort those who mourn. Did you hear miracle there? Go and check Isaiah 61. Did you hear prophecy? Did you hear money, money, money? No. Miracles, signs, wonders, all these things are end parts of confirmation. What they call end credits in filmmaking. All the things we boast with, the miracle, prophecy, signs and wonders, healing. Olumba Olumba Obu has boasted. He challenged the Christian pastors that the healing happens in his name that they should do that in their name. What I will tell Olumba Olumba Obu, oh, oh, oh. I want to tell you something, sir. For the fact that some people merchandise the soul winning business, but there is something I will tell you that you cannot do. Oh, yes. I know what Jesus did that you cannot do. What is that? Death and resurrection. You have never done that. And you cannot show me the fruits of the Holy Spirit because we can extract that with the word of God. Let me tell you, sir, before I conclude. The son of Olumba Olumba Obu, can you go to the grave of your father and the check? If his remains are still in the grave, it means the effort of your dad is nonsensical nonsense because the tomb of Jesus is empty and he is coming back sooner than we expect. There is no comparison between two of you. Watch the video and hear yourself. Tell me which other church leader is being seen everywhere. He stays in one place. He does not go anywhere, but he's seen everywhere. Tell me which other church leader can do that. Which other church leader? Uh -huh. Let them put power in their name now. Because the Lumba has put power in his name. That is why you can see him everywhere. Olumba also has put power in his name. When you call oh oh oh, I challenge all the church leaders. Let them also put power in their name. 
It's enough for them to make noise.